that. My brothers, my sisters, the reason why Madame Nena Akaja Emeli come this morning about this our sister we carry cry come with us a the husband they threaten her life. Madam, come. The husband, they threaten her life. And according to her, he they beat her. Madam, give her a chance, may she pass now. Oh, yeah. Madam, come now. She said the husband, they threaten her life. He they beat her. And uh, she say you no know, comply with um, the court directive we then give. Okay, the children are here. Um, the officer, the officer day for studio, you no know, come, you never come. Uh, Pamela. Please collect microphone. Make one. Now, yesterday after the program, when I they tell me about, uh, uh, please. Now, senior, they sit down for chair. Then you, the senior, carry the junior for leg. Now, so will they do for Africa? <laughs> this is sweet, ha. Huh? See how she smiled. That can, oh. Okay, so tell us what you want to observe about that officer. Good morning, my night president. Good morning, my dear. Good morning, Brechter family. Mm. Yeah, the first day we had her case, he wasn't in the studio. So after the program, at 11 or so, he came in with so much aggression and everything, and he was shouting. My name was mentioned on air. How there that woman who said, calm down. What's the issue? He said the, the wife mentioned his name on air and he has come to clear it. I was like, okay, this is not the right time. You should come back tomorrow by 7 during the program. So we'll all do everything on air. Since your name was mentioned on air. He was like, no, he's not going to take it. That somebody is going to die today. Either he dies or somebody dies. I was like... Did you remember you were a policeman and you're using such a word? It was like, he doesn't care that something must happen. That was when we now told him to leave the office, that we can't entertain this as ruggedness and everything. Then the second time was when he had, um, they had a mediation with consultant Ike and Co. And after, he still went out and was exhibiting a lot of madness and shouting on top of his voice. Consultant Ike. Tell us your experience with this man. Thank you very much, ordinary president. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't get mediation two complete times with this man. Um, the first one, the embarrassment was something we can't understand. Uh, the behavior, he will, we will be talking and then he will just uh, flare up like somebody who has very serious um, uh, emotional or mental issues. So we try to calm him down to understand him. We agreed on a number of things, and then he kept insisting that unless he sees the children, I think it's even three mediation, we brought the daughter in. You remember, ma'am? Uh -huh. And the daughter said how he was behaving in a very unruly way, and that's why they've been trying to avoid letting him know where they are schooling. So we finished that mediation and then expected that she will respond the way we agreed. Gave him time, he will respond. He didn't respond. Now, after a while, the complaint keep coming again. And then the matter was also aired because the initial airing wasn't because this woman brought complaint. She called on a live program, ordinary president, if you remember. Mm. You know when it comes to family matters and also when some officers, they involved. You are uh, they talk, say, make uh, we no do on yes. air, make we try set to lamb. Yes, uh, but she called on live program. Mm. And this man came, kept accusing everybody, including me, that he doesn't have confidence in me. He wants to see Amadeisa, the owner of this place, except he see Amadeisa. He kept saying that. We say, okay, 
he came on the second one with some people he say are his relatives his, some elders uh, some elders so all of them came unhappy the way they, their body language that uh, oh it looks like we're embarrassing this person we want to make him lose his job because the behavior was such that we asked why will police authority be keeping a man with this kind of emotional instability unless in, they are using him for dirty jobs in police service mm. so they came with that uh, body attitude and then i just decided to endure all the insult he was hauling at us i asked everybody to calm down so that he can display before those his uh, elders and uncles and i hear say at the end of the day those elders will come with time they disappointed they became in his ashamed character. they became ashamed of him and then we now agree that they will take him home and work on him for one month mm. and see whether they can be able because when they became ashamed of what he displayed they started pleading with us mm. in uh, the regrets uh, for even coming joining him and they were trying to calm him down he refused so they now we now agree that they will take him home see how they will work with him work on him for one month to see whether they can recover him from the uh, emotional and psychological issues we are mm. seeing being displayed mm. and then after one month if they see any improvement mm. they should mm. bring him back so that we can now see how we will bring the family together but that didn't happen i also kept getting complaints from this woman that uh, he has continued to threaten the woman one other woman from our back called that time to say it's his uncle, uh, auntie, mm. uh, that we are trying to make him lose his job, that they are not happy how we are airing the case in Brekete family. I tried to explain to her to say, did, she, did he tell you, the man himself, what we have passed through mm -hmm. to see that we make peace happen between him and the ex-wife? We're not asking them to come and marry mm -mm. again, but allow her to live her life. Mm -hmm. And don't use your uniform or your position as a police officer to keep intimidating, harassing, and threatening her. And then also let the children be. Even to the extent that the things that uh, it was to pay the children uh, exam fee that time, the one of the child exam fee, he's, he said he won't pay. I offered to pay. The man refused. mm, -mm. Okay, thank you very much. And um, I even the Jessica told me so many things she observed. But uh, no, let me quickly leave them. Um, uh, bottom line now, be say we will not go happy, make a losing job because yesterday now waiting they emphasize be that. That na emotional blackmail. You know what you do. You know say consequences day. Just one second, mm. because as you just mentioned, emotional blackmail. That was what he was doing all through. And then what he usually do is that when you start the case, he will say he don't have confidence in you anymore. He did it in more than four different places that we have. As soon as you start the case and he start to act and misbehave. You try to calm him down. He will now say he don't want you to continue because he doesn't have confidence in you. Yesterday, mm. least where he pay, bride no bride price, no least yes. where they give him for marriage. Mm. He bring him. Yeah, but marriage don't. These break children that uniform sense. when they they come come, <laughs> he bring him. Mm. You see, when they talk this thing, they laugh. One man don't kill his wife for Boarina. And this man, they carry gun for police. So. No, be small gun. This one, where will they talk now? For his position in police, gun follow for waiting in the take walk. And Yesterday, the they say he carry three drunk uh, men where they they drunk. They carry motor with no number plate. They park down there. The three men been the struggle say they won't enter carry bag with, with the suspects say guns they inside when he manage enter our ed nine make sure say those ones no enter <clears throat> excuse me and after our program yesterday he was captured as saying some things i cannot repeat on air while he was walking away with those his three drunk friends. 
We they talk and like play, like play. Make it they established on record before somebody go lose in life. Because he gave away thing I observed yesterday. And I'm not comfortable with the result. I fear for this woman. And I fear for my staff. Yes. Nigerians make one take note. If anything happened to this woman or the children or any of my staff that we cannot explain. Please take note. I don't know. I don't know why this kind of thing go, they go on. And the authority, if you talk now, they go say, they, they wait for us to do an official report. In the U.S., you go just do small video or catch audio sent to the authority. They will call the officer to order and investigate. Here, even sometimes we go write petition, go give force headquarters. They go talk, say, the letter don't lose, our file don't lose. Something is fundamentally wrong somewhere. But Nigeria will be better than it is by the grace Amen. of God. Madam, we could not go back, go sit down. Okay, sir. Anytime okay. when he come, we still expect him till the end of the program. Okay, sir. But we go hear from Adam Nenna, uh, waiting she get to talk first. You can Thank go you. back while she is talking. Thank you, sir. Let's appreciate them. He gets so who be that now? Coach, they tell me say he get one day where the man talk say in daughter they disrespect him. He say even get audio evidence. They say by the time he played the audio evidence, within then they hear the daughter they call and uh, tell her, uh, "Daddy, sorry, daddy." I they say our daddy scaffold talk say if now not picking where they no bring up well. She for you did there, I daddy. Did, I did. Now one of the mediation also. Mm -hmm. he you see, he always have multiple claims, and those claims, if he begin to talk, you will think he's genuine. But when you ask him to put forward the evidence, you will see a totally different thing. He claimed that part of the reasons why he doesn't want to take care of the girl because he was saying it's not that he doesn't have the money when we offered to help if it is money. He said no, that the girl disrespects her him that whenever they talk, the girl was here. We say, come and uh, tell us how you did. He said, no, this is how I've been. Now, he say he has audio. We ask him to play the audio. As soon as the girl called, he started abusing, harassing the, the girl. girl. On the, so, and the girl just On the patient. audio evidence. Yes, you, and the girl was patient saying, daddy, please, daddy, no, daddy, this is what I'm asking. Until throughout that conversation, not an insult from the girl that, that the scaffolds looked at it and say, hey, what are you talking about? Oh, thank God. See the ogre. They don't enter. Please continue what you are saying. Uh -huh. So that the scaffold say, what are you talking about? So even after that also, we still insisted that this girl should go and kneel down and beg him. In front of the entrance there, the girl went and kneeled down and begged him. Madam Nenna, over to you. Good morning, ordinary president. Good morning, morning Bereketa family. Yes, Nigerians, where they here also, both home and abroad, we agree to now. Ordinary president, thank you so much for the great value you add to nation, to life, to humanity through this process. Thank you, ma'am. We want to continue to pray for you for increase in wisdom so that you continue to bring homes together. Mm. Now, this there was something you said at the introductory um, lecture you gave, you said people should purge themselves of the bitterness in them. So that when one, you say prayers, God will answer. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. So that you will even free yourself to move, to move forward. What I observed yesterday, a lot of stored up bitterness, a lot of stored up anger, a lot of misunderstanding and misinterpretation of fundamental issues. I'll give an example. To make children, it takes two to tango. If it is not so, then a man will not get married. 
On your own, as a man, you cannot have children. On your own, as a woman, you cannot ha have children. Take it further. If you don't have life given by God, so you can't even boast of that life because it's of God. And there are basic wrong ideas in the head that must be removed for what these efforts were making to come through for the family. Now, the man has moved on. The woman has moved on. I say also the same thing for both sides, the man and the woman. Purge yourselves. Make up your, free your mind to move on. So that for the sake of these children, that's where it is. And their safety. If there are strong allegations of threat, we need to take that very seriously. We cannot overlook that. And these children were trying to make peace so that they too can grow up not in bitterness. It's very key. And so it's important that this process runs through. And this is an opportunity for both the man and the woman. Everyone who got married legally did. They have their own experiences. So put it behind. Everything you have experienced. People buy cars of millions and then they get and it crashes and the car goes. And so you count it also as one of the, and then move on. You don't die with what that experience. So what we're saying is for the man to free us. We're not here to antagonize any party. You will have your job. But again, we're also helping you to purge yourself so that you can better deliver on the job that you have at hand. On both sides, the woman too has some business she's running. So we are here to add value. We are not on anybody's side. We are on the side of the truth. We are on the side of peace. We are on the side of making things work. Because these children are also great leaders that we are trying to inculcate values into their lives. And so we should not allow negative values to be negative uh, energy. Up, yes, mm. around them. They are so beautiful. They are, not, not they are only beautifully be made. Ma not only beautiful they are peaceful yeah look at them and look at the smile they don't on look faces. like children from a broken home let's oh. appreciate the woman some women after this kind of separation for two three years you the children will be wayward for and any woman that is able to put her family together like that, please, let's appreciate her. Thank you. Thank you, ordinary president. Thank you very much. They are peaceful. They are well behaved. Did you see the emotion yesterday yes. on the son? Yes. He wasn't comfortable that his father and mother are so openly yes. disgracing the themselves. The language is that he, he was crying peace. when he, he was peace. led out of the studio. And this I will end by appealing. Let what has happened in the past remain in the past. We're in the present to make peace. For the sake of your children. For the sake of God. We are not even the owner of your life. I'm sure you know the story of the rich man. Ah, today I've made so much. Let me sit down and make merry. God said, you fool. Today I'll demand of your life. That's the end. And so you don't own your life. On both sides. And so let us allow this mediation. Let's add, truly add value. Let this family live. And if there is any threat, let it end today. Let them be. The children, the wife, and yourself. Your job you will have. We are helping you to even shape yourself well to do that job better. So you must appreciate the Berekete family. Appreciate. You've been wanting to see ordinary president. So when he talks, I expect that today you will listen. And if you require apology, including us here, me, I will apologize and put everything in the past so that we'll move forward. For the sake, the children are still bearing your son name. It means that they are your children. I'm saying this because I expect that you allow, you said you are an intelligent officer. I expect that you allow that intelligent girl, that indicator, that antenna that you've been using to work. Let it indicate to you that we're on the side of peace. And so leave everything you have experienced in the past. People pay higher bride prices and their wives die. 
So what are you going to do? Go back to the grave and collect the bride price or the list. So you are God has kept you alive so that you will enjoy these children. They are great children. They Madam will make Nen you proud. Thank you very much. Ordinary Thank you President. very much. Let's appreciate Madam Nen. <clears throat> Something is telling me that these children will take care of this man yes. by the grace of God. Yes, ordinary. I see it very well. Great future. Because now only God knows they can pray away the father they pray. Mm. We make the children no scatter. Mm. True. Any prayer where you they pray, continue that prayer. God don't answer your prayer. Amen. But you need to take of bitterness of your heart. Today, when it don't come, we don't go waste time, too much time on this matter. The one way go walk, go walk. The one way no go walk. True. Ordinary now only God, if you solve every problem. True. So make we appreciate the officer, even as he come late. Let's appreciate him. You can sit down, sir. Yes, my mic is behind you. Give him the mic, please. Officer, good morning, sir. No, you're not talking good to Good morning, them. sir. Yesterday, as we did round up the, the program, somebody sent text message. Say... The, the person talks in a witness, the person B. We don't know whether not he or she. Say, now confirmation say you they beat this woman. Hmm. This woman talks, say, the time where they come they send officers to come and uh, investigate. They say the easiest description where the people get are then they try to locate your house. Now, that man with a beating wife. Officer, my advice to you is let us not continue this matter on air. What do you think? Talk to me. The mic is with you. Um, it is an advice. But whatever thing you want us to do, we will do. Thank you so much. Yes. A day comes the life and a day ends the life. Over and over and over, this matter has gone on air. So when she go out of body, there is no need to say remove the cloth. We are the cloth. It's already on the body. Okay. So we should continue. I don't have option. It's already on air. Even since I'm Can you talk to the mic? Yes. Even since I'm coming, it's already on air. So there is no need to remove it on air, sir. You see, <clears throat> why are they talk so now? Because waiting you don't hear. No rich waiting you go here soon. If you think say you don't hear and finish. You never hear anything based on the investigation with the foreground. Now make her they advise you. No problem, sir. I believe in God. And he is the author and finisher and the founder of the real truth and the lie. Officer. Put on mic. Please. This mic is not as heavy as a rifle. And so please just hold the mic this way. Sorry. Pending when we finish our talk, sir. It's all right. I still the advice you, sir. Because you get some things where people tell us where your wife no even mention, and they are ready to say it on air. Officer. The things where you hear on air no reach the ones where you go here. Me, I the advise you. How old are you, sir? I am closer to 50. I am your elder brother, sir. No dispute. I am by far older than you, sir. 
I they advise you now elderly advice I they give you so no use anger destroy yourself in the first place if to say this woman now waka she waka come the way other complainants they carry complaint come you for no hear this matter on air but sorry, I immediately responded and dropped my two phone numbers in case uh, if uh, there is call me out of the line uh, like other network do. The matter keep on going online over and over and over. Uh, excuse in me. In another way that is not even contrary to the topic. How many times they don't mediate over this matter not on air between you and your wife? How many times? On 2nd March. How many times they don't mediate over this matter where no be on air? outside inside the compound here where they do the mediation how many times they don't do mediation will not be on air the matter coming on air is what brought me here after on um, second march i came on third march after how many times have we done mediation between you and your family about three times now and that same three times it was on air before i came then appointment follow like as I came yesterday, you give me an appointment today, then it was out of air. Like on 6th June, it was on air on 15th June, on 16th June. Then I came on 16th June. Ah. Ordinary. Ma, should we continue? Ordinary. Sir, I'm afraid for you. Ordinary president. I don't think you don't need to be afraid of me. On what Not standard? afraid of you. Who are you for me to be afraid of? I say... Ordinary. I I fear for you. Ordinary president. The consequences we go follow out of this thing. Now they fear for you. No be you are they fear. So you don't need to fear for me because I know there Ordinary. are there are crimes. I kill nobody. I did not rob person. I did not rob person with arm. This is a woman we I, that is my own family. It comes in this way and it has come to this way. Ken and Eben, they are one mother, one father. Something happened. Abraham is husband to Sarah, and he's also the, the father to Hagar, uh, to Hagar to Ishmael. I am not the beginning of, uh, of marriage dispute, and I may not be the end. My problem is these children. They are my children. If she really wants to tell the world that I am the father of these children, after divorce, which she requested for 14 years ago, and it was granted to her by true legal, legal rule, rule of court, 14 years back after divorce, you are beating your wife, you are beating your wife. After 14 years divorce, I have been managing my life. The topic of threat, threat, threat is to indict me. The whole world is hearing. No threat, nothing. I go about my business. The job I'm doing, which everybody has been hearing. Nothing. Sorry. Nothing. Yes, my let me round up. Nothing. Yeah. If she know that I am the father of the children, let her allow me to take care of my children. Let them hear my language and understand my body language. But if she reason well, I am not the father of the children, she know who is the father. Give them. Let me live. Let me live. Let me not die in the matter. I have suffered so much. All little dying, all little Sarala gates have ended up with this case. To get even one room is only by the grace of God. Do I have to give see, up? See, officer, when what? you talk small, you know, life is about when you talk, you listen. I don't know clue. Um, Thank you, ma. When you talk, you listen. Thank you, ma'am. Eh? All of us, you see all of us here. The ordinary president. <clears throat> we have come. It's out of the love we have, and we want this matter to end well. Thank you, ma'am. Ordinary president, please, I would, I would ask for an interim. Let me go out with him and my oddly. Let's talk and yeah. come back. I want just one minute. We will come back just by the back there. Madam. Please come with me. They are of the same rank. Madam. With my oddly. If you please permit me. Madam Nenna. Yes, ordinary president. You see, when you want to save small child from trouble, it is, it is your responsibility even when the child is proven stubborn for you to insist. It's true. You must rescue the child. You're right, ordinary. You're but right. when you are As dealing an with, elder, yes. But when you are dealing with an adult that is supposed to know what is coming his or her way and you try to even give the person a clue and the person is still telling you he or she is ready you see 
trying to take him out now, outside to discuss with him, might be interpreted wrongly. Allow him. I'm going to ask him for the last time. Because uh, hey, you want to talk? <clears throat> I'm going to ask Ordinary him for the last time. Now, the same thing where you talk. Now, the other one, I go good when, she, when he finish. Uh, when he finish, then I go talk the other one. But this one now, where you talk, now might be one say no, Mac, Madam Nena, no, take him out. The way Madam Nena, see, no, I have seen Madame this Nena, man. Madam Nena, allow him. please allow come him. out. I have I sat in meeting with this man for three times. He said about three times. Ah. Now three times, I don't sit with him on air or out or off out, air. Off air. And uh, what is playing out? is the list of what played out in all of those meetings. There were some meetings that when he starts, I will fold my hand and begin to wait and watch because you can't... Okay. So, officer. Yes, sir. Over to you. Thank I will you. ask you for the last time. Thank you. And I want you to listen to me, sir. Do you still want us to continue this matter on air? Yeah, we are. I want. Okay. Ordinary, so be it. Thank you. Ah. Um. We are interest or, or interest of audience here. If there is any other decision you take, I can't uh, obstruct it. I am still with you. So let me ask this question. What? Ma, do please you want? allow him. I've asked him this question three times. I want, allow him. I want my children. I want my children. The children is the seed of the reason why I am here. I want my children. And I am capable enough to take care of them to any level until God take me home. Okay. Um. Ha. You see... Destruction is destruction. But the worst form of destruction is self-destruction. Yes. Uh, sir, with what I have on ground, I don't want us to continue because they may end up arresting you from here, out of this place. 